The glory of God is man fully alive. The life of man is the vision of God. What does it mean to be fully alive? How do you define it? What is the measure of the fullness of life? There are some questions so important in our lives that even if we would spend our whole lives trying to answer them, no time would be wasted. They are the only questions that ultimately matter. What it means to be fully alive is one of those questions. Catholic education done well is the best way to find the truth about the fullness of our lives. It is the privileged place where parents and educators work together to help their children to see God in heaven by learning to see his mark first in all created things. In a Catholic school, both faith and reason work together to open our eyes and strengthen our hearts to know and love God as he deserves to be known and loved, totally. At the dawn of creation, the glory of God became visible for the first time. Every piece of stardust, every nebula and moon, every plant, animal and vista visibly manifests some aspect of our Creator. And yet, none of these creations achieve their purpose without man, God's image and likeness, appreciating them with wonder. At Bishop Ryan, studying the effects of God's creation in the natural sciences is a way of contemplating the plenitude of God's perfection. The fine arts nourish our soul's thirst for ultimate beauty as a window into the desirability of God. Mathematics teach us that order and harmony undergird all that exists. As the wisdom of Solomon proclaims, God disposed all things by measure, number, and weight. Language arts inspire us to seek to know and communicate the truth that sets us free. History tells us not only of the works of men, but also the works of God, whose greatest work was to make his dwelling among men. Friendships formed lead us to an experience of this world that is a place that is at once so clearly a gift, and yet not our true home. In all things, God has his hand, if we are educated to see it. Every day at the school is a microcosm of life. It begins and ends with God. It contains things both sacred and secular, nature and grace. Sin still happens, but it is followed by the promise of forgiveness and reconciliation. Life at Bishop Ryan is not perfect, but that is the whole point. That is why families need the school. We are called to perfection, but no one begins there. Not intellectually, not religiously, and most definitely not morally. A Catholic school is a place where daily encounter with Jesus and his church sheds divine light on the world which we study and in which we live. Our parents feel that the best preparation to live in this world is to take seriously the proverb of our Lord. What does it profit a man to gain the whole world? but lose his soul. The passing glory of the world is as the passing reflection in our eyes of the sunset that marks each day's end. It is meant to point us beyond. We are here but a moment. We need to prepare well. Only in the face-to-face -face vision of God will we find the fulfillment of our lives, will we be fully alive. So every day at Bishop Ryan, we set out toward that goal with faith, hope, and love. We try to go about our work with prudence, justice, courage, and temperance. We remind our students constantly, nothing in this passing world will suffice for their happiness, and nothing less than virtue will allow them to become what they are called to be by God's design, fully alive.